Hey guys, um, back at it again. Mm -hmm. uh, we should really review or finish the smoothie one. Oh, we have two. Mm -hmm. Anyways, yeah, I don't even know what to say. Like, this is just a continuous thing. You know, just taking forever. It's only been two weeks. It has not been two weeks. Yeah. It's been more like two months. I don't even remember. Oh, we did the jaritos. By the way, I might need to edit that because I don't know when we're going to do that part two. Anyways, today we're um, we're reviewing the County Line Orchard, which is a place by our house. But they have these amazing... Well, it's not really by our house. It's in India. Yeah. And uh, they it's a apple orchard, but also a pumpkin farm during the fall. And they make these donuts that are... Uh, half of them are pumpkin... And the other are apple cinnamon. And so we're gonna we're gonna review these today. So let's get into it. Anything we need to catch them up on? No. no. I can't tell the dif oh there. I can't tell the difference. Which one are we gonna do first? I guess the apple cinnamon. There you go. Is this cinnamon? Just take it, rip it. <laughs> that works. Alright, well, here's a, I believe the apple cinnamon. Is it the apple cinnamon? Yeah, it is. We don't even know what we're trying. <laughs> we hope it's the apple cinnamon. No. Anyway, First of all, they're better warm. Second of all, they're very dry. Third of all, we should have done it as soon as we got the donuts. We should have done it as soon as we got the donuts. Usually, they are what? On a scale. One to ten. We've had them before. Yeah. Eight. Nine. I can go with an eight. Apples and them are made. But if I'm being honest, I prefer the pumpkin just a little bit more. Yeah, but I can't believe I can't tell. Am I colorblind? No, we're just doing this video late at night. That's fair. Is this the pumpkin? Yes. The same texture. There, Dave. Look, compare it. Compare the colors. Ta-da! So it's this one. See, I was right. These are the pumpkin ones. These are the pumpkin. We were not prepared for the video. As a matter of fact, we just both woke up not too long ago. Me, I woke up because my dad ended up saying that I was sleeping wrong on my neck. So I got up, and um, I was talking to my mom. And she ended up saying, you guys need to do that video. You know, donuts are going to get old. By the way, you should always listen to your mom because 10 times out of 10, they're right. And then, uh, so yeah, I, I should have done these right away. But on top of that, um, yeah, then I woke David up. And that's where we're at now. Ooh, these actually look good. By the way, we should probably show what these look like. Well, I can barely know. see it. Eh, whatever. <laughs> we're sorry, but this video is very minimal effort. Very low quality. <laughs> yeah. Like all of our stuff. <laughs> wow. Here you go. Am, am I wrong? Where's this? The pumpkin. Cheers. No, I'm just kidding. We seriously need milk. Granted, most donuts that you leave out. Well, this was in plastic container. But still, the fact that these weren't fresh, you're gonna need to warm them up for what do we say? Five seconds? Ten seconds. Really? Ten seemed a little, a little much. No, because these are thick donuts. That's true. Alright, we say 10 seconds. And, ooh, it depends on the microwave, really. It's good. Right, sorry. Apple cinnamon's getting like a six, 7. Maybe even a 6.5, not gonna lie. No, I say 7. 7's fair. But we can't give it that bad of it because we waited a whole week. Alright. We'll say that we're just knocking off a point for dryness. 6. Very <laughs> dry. 
That is a little harsh. Oh, well, apple cinnamon is good, but not the greatest, in my opinion. I thought it was apple cider. It was apple cinnamon. Apple cider. I don't think there's such thing as an apple cider donut, is there? Anyways, pumpkin one. I love the spice in it. Would this be called the pumpkin spice donut? Nah, I don't like saying that. Because it reminds me of Starbucks. I'm not a fan of Starbucks, mainly because it's overhyped. That's how I am with a lot of things. Apple. Starbucks is good coffee. It's just really expensive. And overhyped. Like mm -hmm. Apple. What does that mean? You know, like, people give it more attention than it should. Like, it's just really big, sort of like Apple. You know how their, like, products are insanely expensive? Yeah. But it's just because of the name? See my point? Yeah. And just certain things that are overhyped, you know, that I'm not a fan of. Hmm. That's just me. Maybe it's just a part of the generation. Of, no, probably not. I don't know. It's me. Anyways, I love this donut. After this video, I'm going back inside, warming it up. I'm going to drink this with some milk, or eat this with some milk. Drink this. Drink this and eat some milk. <laughs> um, man, this, this definitely is one of the non, less enthusiastic videos. That's for sure. How would you tell my joke? Oh, oh you know, I heard that good one. So my dad was telling us uh, jokes the other day, and this is one of my favorites. What is the... Why are art collectors such big enthusiasts of gasoline? Why? Because it makes their van go. That's a good one. You know it. That is. Salt. I find that dad jokes are slowly... In, ooh. The outer edge is like not affected at all. You can find that what? Dad jokes. Before, I hated puns, dad jokes. Couldn't stand them. They're once I got out of high school, started slowly. No, honestly, I think it was more once I was out of college. I started experiencing them more. No, they're just good jokes. Now, I'm just like 50-50, I guess. Dare I say 45-65. I love them. I say them every day. <laughs> oh, what, what was my favorite one? What's the difference between a good joke and a bad joke? Timing. My friend told me that one yesterday. He never said timing. That's even better. Because you don't know when he's going to say exactly. timing. Exactly. And then one day he's just going to come up into you and he's going to be like, David, timing. And he's just going to walk away. Pretty and then much. I'll have so much respect. Wait, which friend? He asked that he be anonymous. Ben? No, no I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I love how we both know where he was going to go. They, they wouldn't get it. They wouldn't. Well, some of your friends would. Hey, actually, maybe. But, not just your friends watching. Yeah. It would just be our inside joke. Oh, no, one it of these is. days. Oh, that reminds me. I got a wedding that I'm going to of a friend. Uh, what's his name? Why did I say what's his name? No, I said, I meant what's the date. December. December 17th. I'm going to my friend Joel's wedding. It's going to be good. And I'm going to do my first uh, trip that's been over an hour. As far as driving. Once I've done is I can... Yeah. Speaking of which, Bobby gave me permission to invite you to come along. So I have a road trip, buddy. When's that? 16th and 17th. Of? December. December? Yeah. We could do, you know, like, road trip. Uh, what was that one that I saw? It was over here, like, every time you go on a road trip, it should look like someone gave 200 bucks to an unsupervised child. true though but honestly I'd probably get a bunch of jerky we haven't had Slim Jims in forever I just think we're talking about our life instead of video stuff and we're kind of stretching out this video we, we are we are video. anyways let them know anything that's going on with you school sucks sucks to suck <laughs> anyways I'm glad I'm out donuts we're good I'm definitely gonna I have to try them fresh. Maybe we'll do that in an Insta video someday. Maybe. I might just do it inside. I might just never do it. You know, like most of our stuff. <laughs> That's true. But, uh, <laughs> we have so many ideas. You know, we never do them. Anyway, what's the next video? I go ahead and do that now. Because if we say it, we'll be. Nah, we won't be held accountable. Oh my god. But we'll Could be a little it more. Could be Halloween candy? We'll do something similar. <sighs> we are going to have a review. 
we should review a food item. A food item. I'm not saying anything else. Inside a haunted house. Ooh. Wouldn't that be more of an Instagram story thing? Like, we're like, guys, uh, ah! Anyways, no. <laughs> I'm just saying. We could be eating pizza while getting scared. I don't know how I, I like that. The only reason I watch scary movies. You don't have to be in front. Even then, I don't watch scary movies. You don't have to be in front. We'll do the conga line. Da, 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 da. No. Anyways. I'm just saying that's an idea. It is an idea. A good one, too. Maybe, maybe. We'll have to see that. Anyways. Apple cider donut, 6.5. Um, pumpkin. That's probably the best pumpkin donut I've ever had, so that's 8. That's the best? These are good pumpkin donuts. But they're still... Alright, what else have we rated today? I w we should keep a list of what we rated. That's too much work. That is. We're lazy. Yes, we are. I'm getting less lazy, but I'm still lazy. Anyways, 6.5 for apple, cinnamon, whatever. Um, 7.5 for the pumpkin. What do you say? Um... I'm going to say a 6.5 for the apple cinnamon and an 8 for the pumpkin. Did you just get on me for saying that? Yeah. But they're not warmed up. If they're warmed up, they would probably bump up a point. Honestly. Really? You think they'd be a 9? I think the pumpkin one would be a 9. I knocked off a point five for just being dry. You're so, so true... <laughs> Anyways, okay, truly, if these were fresh, seven for apple cinnamon, eight for the pumpkin. I yeah. guess a case could be made for 8.5, but I'll just say eight. Anyways, I think that'll be our thing for today. We're going to end this video. You know, this video probably went so long. Already. How do you make an octopus laugh? How? Oh. You give it ten tickles. <laughs> Oh, boy. Anyways, there's our humor for I got, today. I got so many more. We'll save them for the next video. Uh, we'll figure out what the next video is. Um, hey, it might actually be that. I'm actually pretty set on that. All right. Well, we'll see. Or you know, we've if, been doing my ideas, so we'll do yours next. If not reviewing a food, we could always review a haunted house. But that's not our thing. True, but it is the season. It is the season? To be jolly. Don't you dare. <laughs> Why? I'll kill you. It's the beautiful season of Christ the Mass. Okay, see, the way holidays work is October is spooky season. The moment October 31st ends, we got Thanksgiving. And then Thanksgiving season is... Dare I say, until Thanksgiving ends. Not even the rest of November. But if you play Christmas music before that, you're on my hate list. They already have Christmas Shut stuff. Shut up! <laughs> inside I'm the still stores. upset about that. They, first of all... No, no, no. This is a whole nother topic for a whole nother video. We'll, we'll let it be holiday thing. Anyways. Why am I freezing up? We're the end this. Say, we are stretching this. Yeah, we are stretching out. We're Good sorry. donuts. We're gonna review something soon. Um, maybe within the next week. Maybe. Who knows? Let's be honest. It's maybe. gonna be long. No. Anyways, we'll talk to you guys, or we'll talk to the camera. Maybe you next guys week. Later. We could probably review something while we're in the line for the haunted house. It's not bad. Probably should have done that at Bankston's. Oh, quick. <clears throat> Before we go, that's what I was going to say. Uh, we got some seasonings from Growick Boys Barbecue and Rub City Barbecue. And it was, uh, I guess, a seasoning that uh, Matthew Growick made with it. And so we ended up trying those. It's phenomenal on bacon. And I'm going to try the beef one tomorrow. Or even Monday, maybe. I, I really do really want to cheat tomorrow. But but I will try it, and then uh, maybe I'll put a review on that. Just uh, how the seasoning tastes. But it's amazing. Phenomenal. Um, so yeah, you should definitely check out their page if you're into barbecue or, you know, food. or You should just check out their page. It's Grog Boys Barbecue and Rub City Barbecue. They probably know them already. Yeah, but... We're kind oh of yeah, and then he ended up tagging us in his story, so... 
I can die a happy man. That's all I want to say. I Anyways, know. stay chunky, my friends. Stay chunky, my friends.